Testing, testing, one, two, three, and we're up and running. Second take. I know. I'm not too good on, on camera, to be honest with you guys. I know you lot watch my videos and think, oh, we've got bags and bags of confidence, but, you know, I've got 230-odd videos on my channel, and I still actually find it hard uploading content onto my channel because I'm not used to it. This is something not what I'm not used to doing. So, and, you know... It's not easy talking to a camera knowing that everyone, all your followers are watching your channel and they're watching you and they're watching you. So it's all eyes on me while I'm uploading. And um, the more videos I'm uploading, the better I'm getting it and the more confidence I'm getting. So I keep them comments coming in, guys, because it's your comments what inspires me and gives me the motivation to upload more videos onto my channel. But yeah, I had a great day out yesterday with a few of my mates. We went out to um, Hove, which was uh, which is just near Brighton. It's basically the South Downs, um, and it's on waste ground. So it's probably about three or four miles of uh, rough terrain and enduro track. It's absolutely amazing there. I did get pulled by the police coming out of there once before, but because it's not a public highway, it's basically owned by Aldi's, the big firm Aldi's, the supermarket. They own it, and they've owned it for the last 10 years. Um, but they can't do nothing with it because it's on a chalk. The base is chalk, made from chalk, because it's on the South Downs, and it's right beside the A27, the motorway. So I don't know whether they're going to build... Sorry about that. I don't know whether they're going to build a supermarket supermarket on there or not, Aldi's, um, but the police certainly can't do nothing. And the last time when I come out of there, they said, they was waiting for me at the top of the entrance for me, and they said that a few of the neighbours had phoned up and said um, that I was being noisy, or we was being noisy over there. So um, they they issued me with a noise embankment, a section thing. Uh, didn't give me no points, didn't tell me nothing, like have a go at me about the bike. All they could do me for was a noise. So they took my details, basically, and I initially thought, that I'd get something through the post um, about that warning, what they give me, but I never ever got nothing through the post um, and I definitely didn't get no uh, section or noise embankment order or nothing like that or anything like that. So, yeah, so I'm still we're still going over there with a few, few, few of the boys. We're still having a good time over there. How it was yesterday was very, very tacky, very... Um, very slippery because we've had a lot of rain over the last few days you can imagine what chalk gets like it's very very slippery and to get traction on it is very very hard so basically you've got to sit right down the back of your seat and just power through it but when we went over there yesterday um, it has been ridden on because there's quite a few trails still there recent trails so the boys have been over there but the ruts had formed and it was chewed up and it was slippery so, um, well, I haven't been out on my bike for probably a couple of months. You lose a bit of confidence. And um, I wasn't really riding to my full potential, what I normally ride at because of these conditions. Um, I didn't fall off yesterday. I had a few close shaves where the back wheel just, was just like sliding out on me. But yeah, I mean, it's all fun. It's all good. I had all the protections on, so there's nothing really to worry about. And you can't really get up to any high speeds on there because it's um, it's like enduro. So there's a load of twists, there's a load of turns. Uh, there's a few jumps over there. But it's absolutely amazing. My bike, since it's come back from um, having the full service from my friends up in Brighton, Hove, um, Blonde's Garage, it's absolutely running brilliant. It's only When I bought the bike initially last year, it only had um, one hour on it since it had a full engine rebuild and you can still see the gaskets at the bottom of the head so the gaskets are still green and the engine is absolutely spot on but other it's got an other few little bits what needed doing and blonde sorted that out for me uh the tires the brakes the master cylinder rebuild and a few bits like that and they've made it really really safe for me to ride on now so i must get a drink i'm feeling a bit dry actually yeah, so, um, yeah, had a good time on it and felt safe on it. 
I would have liked it to have been a bit drier, to be honest with you, because it's, we've had so much rain over the last few days. It was like a trench over there, and it was slipping out for me and going sideways for me. And uh, yeah, you had to stand up. Thanks, babe. My missus just made me a cup of water. Thank you very much. Thank you. Very dry. Seemed to be dehydrating. When we went, we've been shopping this morning, me and my missus. We went into town, done a little bit, and come back. And um, normally we get sausage rolls in Greg's Bakers when we go to town. But my missus said um, she was going to do a special, and the special is a sausage sandwich. So we had uh, beautiful Cumberland sausages in a sandwich with a bit of brown sauce. So I'm a little bit dry, guys. Sorry about that. But yeah, um, let's hope the weather changes a little bit. And it's, I must say, it's quite nice out today. The sun's out today, but this is when it snows, when it warms up a little bit. So yeah, guys, I'm going to leave this video here, but I will be uploading more content onto my channel this afternoon, guys. As I said to you, I can't let the cat out of the bag yet and let you know what's going on because it's obviously going into my second book. But I'll be reading out um a one one of the chapters of my second book um on my youtube channel later on and letting you know how good it is and what's going into the book it's absolutely amazing and the good news is is is, is it, you're going to like this guys uh, because of uh, you followers are part of my journey and especially especially those followers what have what take their time to comment underneath my videos um you know I've got so much respect for you guys. Look, I'm, you're actually part of my journey, so I'm going to be putting a few of you into my second book. So I'll be um, contacting a few of you and letting you know uh, which ones I'm thinking about putting into the book. But yeah, guys, because you're part of my journey and you know you give me such positive feedback, it's only it's only right that I do something nice for you guys, and that's the least I can do for you. I'm nearly at 1,100 subscribers now. Um, so everything's going up, up, up. We're we're more, we're going upwards and upwards, and the target or the limit is the sky. I've been monetized, um, but I got monetized around the end of December, and I think it takes twenty eight days from there. I'm not too sure what goes on after you get monetized. Anything about the pay in and every, all that? I just haven't got a clue about nothing like that. I haven't really give it any thought really. I'm only uploading content onto my my YouTube really to give you guys an in, uh, an insight into my life, you know, uh, my previous life and also my present life. What what I've got going on now, and I've got so much going on now uh, since I've changed my life and reformed myself. I, I can't even try to explain to you what I've got going on because I've got so many good things going on. There's so many different doors opening. I'm meeting so many nice people. Um, and, you know, a few of my old friends from back in the day before I went on to drugs, um, they didn't take drugs. And I've recently been in contact with a few of my old friends. So it's all good. It's gravy, guys. It's gravy. But anyway, guys, I'm going to leave this one here. I did say to you earlier on, I'll be uploading content all going through the day. So I'm a man of my word and I like to deliver. So have a great day. Stay safe. Much, much respect. Peace.